Good morning and welcome. It's D-Day. It's Saturday, 18th March, 2023. And you know what time it is. It's time for the gubernatorial and state house of assembly elections. I wonder where you are preparing to go out and exercise your civic duties, I hope. I'm sure you've collected your PVCs and you're ready to go out there. Good morning. Welcome to Situation Room from Election 2023. I am Akilachi KJ. You're live on RSTV Channel 22, coming to you live from the Garden City of Port Harcourt. We'll be giving you blow-by-blow -blow updates for what's going on at various polling units in the 23 local government areas of River State. We have our field reporters on the field and they're waiting to just send in those reports. So you will do well to stay tuned or go out and come back and get all the updates on RSTV here. I'd like to say a big thank you for joining us, but I'm not alone. I'll not be doing this alone. I'll have more presenters coming in. Uh, throughout the day, having the conversations, analyzing uh, results, analyzing the situation here in River State. If you agree with me, it's going to be a tough gubernatorial battle in River State. I have uh, presenters joining me like Solomon Nelson Braid, Obu Bele Barapaka, and our head of station, Fingasi Onisoya. I will not be doing this alone as well because we have our field reporters Astute field reporters waiting to give us updates. People like Soprinye Jaja. We have a Justice Ihunwo Ogboka Omeda, who is our head of reportorial, among many others. So stay tuned, and right now we'll be rolling in feed from our reporters on the field. All right, so good morning. This is election day in Opobo, in Koro, local government. We're just behind um, the statue of the famous King Jaja of Opobo. Um, it's a long time history about to be made here. We'll see if uh, the PDP gubernatorial candidate eventually wins. But the, the hope and expectation in Opobo is quite high. And um, the sensitive materials have arrived and have been distributed to various wards. There are 11 wards um, in Opobo, in Koro local government. Eight of those wards are in Opobo. Three of those wards are in Koro. Uh, they've been sent around. So um, it, the materials have been distributed to various um, um, various um, words. Security is top notch. Um, the, the military guys are around. The naval guys are patrolling. Um, the police guys are okay. Um, everybody's pumped and ready to vote. It's, 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 a, it's a voting day because one of their sons is the main man that some people are talking about, Simla Fubara. And um, so the expectation is quite high. Um, the elections haven't started. So we're here and in front of the King Jaja statue, famous King Jaja Pobo statue. Mm -hmm. So Priya Jaja, live and direct in the Pobo in Koro local government area. Mm -hmm. 